Going over the strategies and trades today, no trades today in the Signal Strength Trader. We did not trade live trades for the 250K portfolio today, and the market was continues to be choppy today. Yesterday, the strategies had a big day. That This is the old Stock Index 34. It was up 16K yesterday. Uh, it was in a $67,000 drawdown uh, on an end of day. End of day drawdown was at a new drawdown on uh, Tuesday. Yesterday, it was up. 16,000 today it's down 7,000 and so um, you know it's I guess it's right back around a $58,000 drawdown right now and so um, we're still trying to dial this in and still a difficult difficult market environment and if we look at the S&P 21 it was at a uh, it was in a drawdown yesterday it was in a losing streak near a um, it was in a drawdown alert, but we're still waiting because a lot of these, uh, you know, a lot of these strategies are just uh, we're going through a really choppy period in this market with the, uh, you know, the talks of World War Three, uh, high interest rates at eight percent. Those are some, those are not normal things that uh, we've been talking about for the last twenty or thirty years, or World War Three for sure. Um, and so, you know, the interest rates are probably a bigger effect, but that's a pretty new fundamental the rate of increase in interest rates high level of interest rates uh, mean reverting zero percent interest rates for a long time and so uh, looking for the adjustments continue to do a lot of research working on my money management algorithms and so today the S&P uh, 21 is currently at I'm showing minus 1675 I think this one is um, in a twenty four thousand dollar drawdown I'll have, to, I'll have to double check at the end of the day. See, we're at one strategy is long. Adaptive moving average, kind of a highlight today. It took the short trade, then it took the long trade. But um, if this market rolls over, then that long trade will be a loser. And let's see, momentum reversal is short, while adaptive moving average is long. And so, um, yeah, just a difficult, a lot of, a lot of back and forth in this market. And so, uh, you can see no trades here. Let's look at. The VIX is at 20.94. That is interesting. It's not responding to the tech sell-off as much. And so um, looking at the market, you can see the intraday price action. The NYSE ticks were at the minus 1,000 level down here. Uh, you see the low is minus 1,084 plus 1,177, I guess, up here. And then the advanced decline line, the high was 1019. The low is minus 198, and the price gap down, reversal rally, sell off, reversal rally, and this price is at the 10 o'clock, about the 10 o'clock price, and then it is rolling over. So there is some uh, net change on the day on a very. Um, can you talk about the shorting rally? Shorting rally instead of momentum is is the best has been a, the best approach right now. And the three stages of this market of a market sell-off that we could be seeing are the market uh, chopping around near the highs, starting to sell off with lots of lots of sharp rallies, so shorting those rallies, and then the third stage could be uh, shorting momentum. So stage one sideways, stage two a choppy downtrend where you short the rallies, and stage three a, a sharp sell-off where you short momentum. So. We could be somewhere in here. Uh, we're certainly not in this stage right here. It's been possible to short momentum, even in bull markets, mostly in previous years. It's been difficult to do that. In recent years, though, with all the stimulus that's uh, been lifting the markets higher and, and providing fuel to the dip buyers. So those are the trades on the day. Again, no trades today, down about 725 on the month and on the quarter for the 250K portfolio. Hey, David Bean here. Welcome to Capstone Trading Systems YouTube page. Be sure to subscribe to join our community of algorithmic traders. We are real money traders. We share our winning streaks, we share our losing streaks, as well as market updates, strategies, and coding tips.